Welcome to the Morph Neo channel, where regular and crypto games meet. If you love regular FPS games, blockchain-based NFT and play-to-earn games then subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell to watch our videos, and stay up to date. In our last video, a year ago, we gave a summary of a blockchain-based game called Guild of Guardians. In today's video we give a brief look at where the game stands, whether it's playable and what's new and updated about the project. Let us get started. What is Guild of Guardians? Guild of Guardians is a mobile roguelike squad RPG where players build their dream team of guardians and compete in a guild to earn epic, tradable rewards, defeat foes, and loot. Guild of Guardians is built on the powerful Immutable X Layer 2 scaling solution for NFTs, which allows for access to gas-free minting and trading while providing the security and robust stability of the Ethereum network. The launch of the full game has not changed from our last year's video, you still can't play Guild of Guardians full release. The game was set for a soft launch in mid-2022 but got pushed back to 2023, with an alpha version already available to test the use of gems for voting purposes and early stages of gameplay. The game is under development and is slated to launch on Android and iOS, with a full mainnet release targeted for Q for 2023. How to get started with Guild of Guardians? The first thing you will need to do is pre-register on the main page of the website. After confirming the subscription, the user will have the opportunity to enter personal data which will be required once the game is fully released. Even without the full game, the developers have had a lot of new announcements recently. In May the developer were thrilled to unveil the highly anticipated Guild of Guardians roadmap. Crafted with precision, this roadmap zeroes is on their chief objective, the launch of Guild of Guardians. Although they have a myriad of community events in the pipeline, this roadmap is designed to highlight the key milestones they're aiming to reach as they journey towards the much-awaited launch of GOG. Guild of Guardians, a much-anticipated mobile blockchain RPG, has signed a new development studio partner, MineLoader. According to the announcement, the latest partnership will help the team to ship the game in 2023. MineLoader is a leading game developer that has worked on some of the biggest titles, including Final Fantasy XIV, Final Fantasy Remake, Biomutant, and The Last of Us. According to Justin Hulog, Chief Studio Officer at GoG, the team interviewed 23 prominent studios around the world before choosing MineLoader as the new partner. With MineLoader's expertise, the team hopes to deliver a AAA game filled with high-quality experiences and a sustainable Web3 economy. According to the updated roadmap in the beautiful corner phase, which was planned for Q2 2023 the team will be laser-focused on bringing to life innovative game loops, engaging battle mechanics, immersive dungeon systems, and captivating equipment crafting through merge. To make sure everything is just right, they'll be extending an exclusive invitation to a very select group of playtesters to test the game and provide valuable feedback. The team also announced, in association with Guardians Guild Limited, the launch of GOG NFT staking for the Guild's treasure, Season 2. Guardians Guild Limited has earmarked a substantial total of 6 million GOG for Season 2 rewards of the Guild's treasure. This GOG allocation will fuel both the newly introduced GOG NFT staking and the continued GOG active staking, intertwining the two in a synergistic reward system. Over the course of six months, these rewards will become available. A major portion, for million GOG, will be allocated to active staking, while the remaining 2 million GOG will fuel the NFT staking. As a special nod to the long-standing supporters who have been interacting with the GOG ecosystem, they're planning a retroactive reward airdrop for all NFT holders who meet the set criteria. Following the beautiful corner, they will charge ahead towards the limited beta phase, where they'll implement the valuable learnings and feedback from the beautiful corner, and begin the development and implementation of new game features, including Auto Battler Mechanics Hero Equipment and NFT Integration Merge Crafting Summoning System and Story Mode Web3 Integrations Further on the roadmap the pivotal open beta launch will see the launch of Guild of Guardians on mobile, where players will experience the integration of all core game features, including an in-game storefront, leaderboards, gem rewards, and key NFT integrations. 
But that's not all, expect further refinements to elevate your user experience, alongside crucial improvements such as device compatibility. These are some of the interesting and new things about GOG, and you can find more in this article as well, which we've also linked in the description. That's all for today. We hope that our quick review about the news and updates were helpful. What do you think about Guild of Guardians? Would you like to play with this game? Please share your thoughts about the game in the comment section below. If you like this video, please give a thumb up, we would really appreciate it and please make sure to subscribe to the Morph Neo channel not to miss our next video, and hit the notification bell. Thank you for watching and see you next time in our next game review, gameplay, or tutorial video. Bye.